welcome back to another vlog my name is Deanna if you're new welcome and if you're not new thanks for coming back to another video so it's happy Friday it's Friday morning it's actually 903 I'm expecting we, I was supposed to have a phone call with my um who is she technically hold on my admissions representative yeah she's my admissions representative that's like assigned to me to help me get everything set up with school you guys because i've been kind of slacking and behind i haven't done my new school orientation and all that stuff so i'm trying to kind of get that together but we're supposed to be having a meeting at nine o'clock and it's 903 and i haven't got a call yet so I just figured I would go ahead and open up the vlog. This is going to be a nice little weekend vlog that we're going to be doing some fun stuff. After this meeting, I'm going to actually get a piercing. My cousin does piercing, so I'm super excited. I told you guys about this in the last vlog. If you watched it, if you haven't, it'll you guys can go watch it. But um, yeah, I'm going to be getting a piercing today. I'm going to probably, I might get both, but I don't know. It's the tragus and um, my belly button piercing. She's doing a deal. So I'm like considering just going ahead and getting both. But then I'm trying to think like, do I really want to have two piercings at the same time? You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I'm thinking I'm just going to probably end up getting my belly button. But if I don't, I'll get my belly button and my tragus um and yeah i'm gonna see if she'll let me vlog you know for my channel since it's my cousin and everything so we'll see got off the meeting and it went awesome i'm just super excited you guys and she pretty much was able to answer all of my questions even though um she's in admissions and she's not an advisor and she was like most of the questions i did have were for advising but pretty much what i need to do is complete my um finish my online new student orientation and then I'll be able to register for classes. And now I pretty much know exactly what I need to take um, in order to be able to um, get into the nursing program. So I have two options, you guys. You guys know that this is not my first time in school. So to be honest with you guys, so pretty much what it would be like, this is what it, my nursing program would look like. Um, Semester one and two are my prereqs to the nursing program. And then what's in bold is the nursing program. At this point, you can I would be able to take my RN two-year uh, program. So I'd be able to have an ADN, which would still qualify me as a... Um, this will still qualify me as an RN. And that is my goal. However, if I didn't want to stop there, then I would include these semesters which is a partnership program we have with one of our state colleges and that I can go ahead and just go straight on and get my BS in. So we'll see how that goes. My goal is to just get here. Um, and this is like so attainable for me. I just feel really good about this. So in reality, like I said, though, this is not my first time in school. So I have taken these all of these classes, but I have not taken them recently. I've taken them years ago. It's been at least three years now that I've been out of school, um, except for my CNA program that I did. But yeah, so I just feel like even though I've taken them and I could technically rush into the nursing program and try to like start next fall, which is what I want. I would rather just take these classes over because I really need a strong foundation in chemistry and anatomy one and two and microbiology to be able to successfully complete the nursing program. I don't want to just rush myself. I don't remember everything. So, you know, that's just what I'm going to do next year. Is I'm going to take I'm going to do year one and then we'll continue to go on. Um, this chemistry does have a prereq. So I'll have to take a class over the summer so I can take the biochem the organic chemistry or whatever unless i want to go somewhere else but yeah this is pretty much what i'm looking like for the next either two or four years of my life and i'm super excited so yeah all right y'all so we are heading to get our piercings now and i don't know i before i left i'm like i'm just gonna get my belly button piercing now i'm like let me just get both like i don't know i'm so indecisive you guys like i'm super indecisive but we're on our way it's a little bit far so i'm not happy about that so we'll have to probably get gas on the way back but we're on our way and then we got to run and take grams somewhere and then i'm supposed to be having a meeting at 12 o'clock but i don't think i'm gonna be done in time because i'm not gonna get there until like 10 30 and i oh i gotta go back home I'm even gonna be even a couple more minutes behind because I gotta run right back to the house real quick, but it's cool. Well, I guess I gotta 
do this and then I gotta go run take my gram somewhere and all these places are kind of like not different places excuse me and then my goal was to be back at home to do um for my meeting um but I don't think I'm going to be so I need to get my airpods um sometimes I don't be feeling like carrying a purse y'all I don't know why but yeah, I don't be feeling like carrying no purse, so that was kind of the thing. I'm so excited though because we're going to get some clothes. I'm going to be doing a haul for you guys, like a fall haul. We don't have no, we need like, we just need stuff. So we're going to do a little bit of shopping today, so I'm super excited about that. I'm going to also order a new waist trainer as well as a sweat, uh, not sweatband, a booty band. Um, so I'm really excited about that actually. Um, from Amazon, I got a couple things to do. So I got, I made my list, but I need to just go ahead and run these errands real quick. And then hopefully when I get home, I don't have to run it. Hey y'all, so we are done with our piercings. We're actually at Graham's house. I didn't even end up filming because we weren't at her uh, studio. So I just didn't even end up filming, but I got ended up getting both of them. I got my tragus as well as my belly button pierced. You guys can see this is my third time, so it's a little bit. Yeah, this one hurt though, y'all. I'm not even gonna lie. Like this one hurt pretty bad. This is probably I would say the worst one. And I've gotten two belly button piercings, a dermal, my nose pierced. I've got my cartilage a couple times. I got my second hole. But this one, yeah, it hurt. I ain't gonna lie. It definitely hurt, honey. Anyways, y'all, I just wanna check in with y'all. I'll talk to you guys probably when we get back home. Oh. Babe gave me, I mean, babe, Grams gave me a new book to read. This is one of her favorite authors and she has this whole line, I believe. So I'm gonna start that. I really wanna get into just reading more physical copies, just lots of healthy, habits in my life that's what i'm trying to incorporate so anyways you guys that's it i just want to check in with y'all let you know we got the piercing and so far so good i'm obsessed so um i will talk to you guys later <laughs> I just came to Speedway because I needed to um, do something. I came to Speedway or whatever to get some cash out from the ATM. And I wanted a coffee, so I got a little bit of coffee. I got a, a some house blend and I got some more. I thought they had already put up their pumpkin spice um, creamers, but they actually had some silk oat milk ones too they have this one which is the oatmeal uh cookie creamer and i'm like oh that sounds actually kind of good but i meant to get the silk vanilla because i was going to mix it in i don't know how oatmeal cookie in the pumpkin pie spice is going to mix so i'm just going to do pumpkin pie spice oh y'all can't even see anyway hold on but yeah, I just got the house blend. I don't know how much it is, but like I said, the pumpkin spice creamer, y'all, is growing on me. I posted that on Instagram. If you guys are not following me on Instagram, please follow me on Instagram, y'all. I am getting better with my content on Twitter. Not Twitter. I don't have a Twitter, but on TikTok also. So if you guys are, are fans of TikTok, I understand if you're not because it took a while for me to get into it as well. Damn, did that just make my windshield foggy yeah it's a pretty cold day it's a good day for a mid-afternoon coffee I, I didn't have any coffee today so now i'm about to go to o'reilly's i need to grab something from the car store so oh still real bitter let me put some of this down like i am a person you guys like i like to taste the coffee but i don't like bitter coffee 
I don't think anybody does, but I definitely like it to be sweet too. Hopefully this uh, oatmeal, oatmeal cookie will help. Oh, it smells really good. I got something to oh, the oatmeal cookie just really smells so good. You can my I promise we'll find love again. So I just want to do a quick little haul. I just came out of Dollar General. Didn't have too, too much luck. But I did want to show you guys these cute little gloves I got. I found these for three bucks. So I'm like, they're three in one gloves. Oh, that's cute. Okay, that's cute, yeah. So anyways, I picked those up. And then I picked up some for babes as well. And then I picked up one of these for the bathroom because I figured this would be good for the bathroom. Just one of these little air wicks. And it was only three bucks and it came with the plug-in and these. And somebody's vlog I was watching today, they were saying that this is actually pretty good. And that this is what they get when they don't get the wallflowers from um, Bath and Body Works. So I'm like, let me just see how fragrant it is for the bathroom. I'm assuming it will be good enough. And then I also picked up at the hardware store some... Um, black ice little things for my car and I got this one for babe and I picked up some coolant that's what we needed so yeah that's it I think that concludes my errands so babe's gonna get off work soon and we're gonna go shopping so I'm really excited about that because when I say I need some fall clothes and a fall wardrobe, like that's literally what I mean. Yeah, I just wanted to check in with you guys. I feel like I've been in the car a lot today, so I'll try not to vlog anymore in the car for the rest of this vlog and show you guys some different things. But I'm just so used to talking to you guys. I really miss you guys. And I'm so used to being in the mood to <laughs> film. So yeah, y'all, they didn't hit me up twice. They didn't have one nurse and now the second nurse hit me up and said they have openings all weekend do I want to pick up? And I'm like, no. No, no, no. I honestly consider picking up on Monday, but I don't know you guys, cause I really want to use that day to work on some business stuff for YouTube, for the glam shop and all that stuff. So I don't know you guys. just got home me and babe just went to rainbow and just looked for a couple different fall items we really need to get our fall wardrobe up so we're just kind of getting started so we went to rainbow and city trains we didn't find anything well babe found one thing at city trains i didn't find anything and i did find a couple items at rainbow so i figured i would go ahead and show you guys it's not gonna be a super long haul um but i still want to show you guys so the first thing i picked up is this cute sweater and it's like in a blush pink and it just has a little hood on the back and it's a little distressed on the bottom so i thought that was really cute and it's a like v-neck here and this was 12.99 the next thing i got was another sweater and it is this super cute pink like uh cheetah print one hot pink and it's a super cute again it's v-neck it has a hood and has a distressing on it and this was 15 dollars. So i thought that would be a cute little sweater to throw on with some leggings both of those actually um i also picked up two pairs of black leggings these ones which had this cute little rouging detail on the butt i thought that was kind of different and cute and then i got these thick ones that are like a sweater material that are like thicker so I won't be so cold since it's getting colder here. Um, the next thing I got is this cute little cropped hoodie or sweater that just says baby girl. And then I got a, the last thing I got is this cute little sweater 
two piece and I got it in black. And this is how the top looks. And then this is how the bottoms look. Just super simple and cute but i think that's gonna be super duper cute on okay y'all and then we also went to dollar tree of course so i picked up a couple of things so i've been i'm really trying to get my sticker collection back up so i picked up three things of planner stickers they had and they're just 300 pieces and these are the only designs that they have so i thought these ones were cute so it looks like this on the front and then it's a different one on the back and then this one. All right, y'all. So, of course, I ran out of space. And then the last ones I got were these set of stickers. And these are more like appointments and stuff. Oh, that's so cute, babe. It's like our sweater. Yes. With crap. Bomb. Yes. Okay, girl. And then I also got these cute little silver glitter stickers for my budget binder book. I'm going to show you guys. I do. So I'm starting to implement like cash envelope stuffing and like um like a budget binder kind of book. Like I'll show you guys how I'm going to set it up. So I needed some stickers to decorate it and label it and stuff. And then I also picked up this two pack of popcorn things from Dollar Tree. Um, me and baby are going to do a movie night. We got this, excuse me, for our popcorn. So we got that, came in a two pack for a dollar. We also got this three pack of movie butter popcorn to go in that. Um, they've got some of these reusable gloves. You wanna try those out. I needed to get one of these, um, these chargers for one of my devices. I got a, this is the My Beauty Spot Jade Facial Roller. I really been wanting to try one of these, put it in my skincare fridge and get it all um, cold and just see how it does on my skin. These are for babe. Babe got these also. And then we got some Lysol Clean and Fresh for the house. This smells so good. And then I also wanted to try one of these. This is the Makeup Vanishing Towel. I think this is compared to the Makeup Eraser. I've seen somebody I watch on YouTube that tried this and said it's actually really good. So that's everything that we got, you guys. Just a quick little haul. I'm pretty happy with all my purchases. So now I'm just getting ready to try all my stuff on and put everything away. And then, like I said, I'm going to take my shower. And me and babe are going to have us a movie night and eat our dinner. And, yeah, that's pretty much going to be it till tomorrow. So um, that's probably all I'm going to vlog for you guys. So I will see you guys tomorrow in the next clip. Or if this wasn't long enough to be its own vlog, maybe I'll see you guys in the next vlog.